So acute respiratory infections, infections of the lungs, um, caused by a broad group of organisms, but all attacking the same organ and causing illness in the same way, um, are the third leading cause of death in the world each year um, for adults and children. Um, but in children particularly, uh, children under five, this is the group of illnesses that are the leading cause of death, and as many as two million children each year die in the world from acute respiratory infections, and many of these deaths um, are preventable and treatable. Um, with tools that we have now, we just have to figure out how to get them to more children, to get them to more adults around the world, um, and some tools that should be within our grasp if we would only increase our commitment in research and development to things like vaccine production, to things like antibiotic development, to things like improved access to diagnostics um, and uh, readily available treatments that exist in many parts of the world, um, but not in enough places where these diseases are killing children. The Acute Respiratory Infections Atlas is a unique resource that combines data regarding the drivers of acute respiratory infections, the scope of the problem that outlines solutions to the problem, really drawing data that has not been available in one place up to now. Um, and so now with the Acute Respiratory Infections Atlas, public health workers, advocates, journalists, policymakers can find in one location uh, information that describes the extent of the problem, the underlying causes of the problem, the steps needed to address the problem, and backs all of this up with absolutely the most current, thorough, credible data on the solution that's available from the best researchers in the world. And now it's all in one place in a way that we think is easy and accessible uh, for people to use.